Jake Paul and KSI both released new songs. What a surprise. So you've said this on the podcast before. Yeah. He, Randolph thinks that there's like some correlation between every time JJ releases a song, Jake Paul seems to. And it can't really be the other way around because JJ does announce his songs quite a, yeah. a way away. Yeah. Um, well, it's because the first two literally both came out on the day JJ dropped his. Yeah. And Jake Paul didn't announce he was going to do it. He just dropped it. However, we've done a bit of research on this one and he released it a week earlier on Spotify. Yeah. And now a lyric video two days before JJ's. Yeah. So I don't think it's, a, I think it's just a coincidence. Well, I feel like JJ was meant to release a music video this last Friday. He did announce. He you did know the one I'm talking about. Uh, no. The one he showed us in the chat. They couldn't put, oh. Yeah. Has he redone it? Yeah. Got you. But got I remember you. he said he was going to post, he was like, oh, I'll get ready for this. Yeah. How long ago did he release Loose? A while ago now, like a month or so. Yeah. That's when Jake Paul's song came out. That's when he's, um, 23 was it yeah same day okay let me look when let me look when it came out the plot thickens but if it's not you know on purpose it's very very like coincidental it is it's cool though i'll take it two reactions yeah, it in was, one it was a month ago. <laughs> come on uh yeah it was a month ago i mm. just saw a couple of the top comment was whenever ksi wears glasses you know he's gonna put on an accent <laughs> <laughs> god damn it true though um but i've always thought like Jake Paul's last two songs, mm -hmm. I've thought they seem ghostwritten. Not mm -hmm. they are, but based on like evidence that people have yeah. come forward with and stuff like that, it seems like there's a chance. But they've been decent. Yeah, fresh out of London. Similar. Twenty three. I, I like them. I got to be honest. I do like them both. But they are very similar. Yeah, of course. Then he's released this new one. And it's called Dummy. Yeah. Ah, it's really bad. It ain't it, Chief. Yeah, it's bad. I don't like it. And Randolph really likes the other ones. Like, uh, and I, like, like, I do actually really like them. <laughs> like, I think the only yeah. thing holding me back is that fact that like it's Jake Paul. This, I, one I just, sick. this one, all the comments are, you can tell Jake actually wrote this. Yeah, one. yeah. He shouldn't have switched it up. He should continue making songs like that every single day of his life. <laughs> but I think this one still is, it's the similar style, but then he's gone like thrown in 6 9 yeah, his flow. Yeah, his flow wasn't great. Lyrics weren't great. I do like the beat though. I, I actually still like the beat because obviously, what's the feature on it? TV Gucci. Yeah, I actually really <laughs> is like his that verse. What it's <laughs> That's a weird name, isn't it? It is. He's signed to OVO, I think. Jeez, but I, I really like his verse. So it shows the beat's not the, the issue. But it's, to be fair, though, against you know, sometimes you miss TV right? Gucci. Yeah, sometimes you miss. Like Jake Paul, like his previous two songs were decent. This one was not. Maybe next time he'll bounce back. Yeah. It... <sighs> It is a people make bad songs and also you gotta remember like they have to experiment as well yeah for sure it's just a it is a weird one because you listen to it and you hear jake paul's first verse and then chorus yeah and you think like i didn't really like the beat but then i heard tv gucci on it and i was like oh actually this beat's kind of good yeah now you can hear someone can flow yeah, on now it. you've heard someone sicker on it yeah i don't know if he's gonna release a music video for it or if he's just gonna you know chuck out could it, it could have been like a tester couldn't it yeah in which case it could just be literally a throwaway almost, yeah but. yeah yeah, I mean... They could have seen JJ Poston and been like, crap, we've not gotten ready. Just quick, quick. Video. <laughs> yeah. yeah, get to the studio quick. Mm, but, um... Yeah, I mean, it's it's not... It's not the best. No. It's it's definitely not 23 or for Charlotte. Nah. It's, and the fact he didn't release a video with it either, I don't think it's going to hit the same regardless. No. Did, did well, though. Like, two mil already. Seems pretty solid. Let me, let me look. In a couple on, of days. So, it's on 2.4 in yeah. five days. Yeah. On Spotify, I feel like he doesn't get that many. Not compared to JJ, but JJ has been uh, smashing it. 260k. How many was 23 on? Is on? 23 is now on 3.2. That's solid. And Fresh Out of London is actually on 10.4. Ooh. Yeah. 